Hello everyone, welcome back to the DOS TV. If not the first time with the city channel, make you know our car pass, make you like and share and subscribe. As you do that, may God bless you. All my amazing returning subscribers, you all are welcome for your amazing support. May God bless every one of you. I got the video one that I want to drop. What do I think about this video? Put it in the comment section. Please like the video, share the video. If you never subscribe, subscribe and press the bell so that me they join the movie train as they move. As you do that, may God bless you. I see you guys on my next video. Bye bye. <laughs>
But what we are not commending is for people like China Sangworu, for China Sangworu to come and start blabbing. They are running from pillar to pole. That, oh, you see, when they tell you that uh, we are not in charge of ESN is a lie. These are criminals. We are in charge of ESN. This is Lion Squad. They are protesting in, on the, in the street of Onicha. So what they are trying to do now, by the way, what they are trying to do now is they are struggling, struggling, struggling to prove to you that they still have some control. They still have some control over some men. They have control over some men. So the video of the Lion Squad you saw on social media on the 13th of January, that, that was yesterday, they are now coming to tell you, oh, you see, these are our men. But that video was on the 13th. They didn't post it. Some of them, like the bed bug, the criminal China Samuru, is posting the video today on his page. And he, he has instructed all the media, Irat and Amajri, to start broadcasting, to start sharing the, the, the video and the picture of the Lion Squad protesting at, in Onicha. Telling you, you see, when they tell you we are not in charge of ESN, we are in charge of ESN, this is the Lion Squad. And again, they are exposing our ESN. They are not telling you Lion Squad is ESN. Of course, we know we have different squad in ESN. They are now coming to tell you this is the video of the Lion Squad. They are protesting. And I want you, in as much as I am commending the Lion Squad, you know, even though they are not much in number as usual. And you can notice that they are not much in number as usual. You know, when Lion Squad come out, usually they come everywhere. But if you look, if you look at that video, you find out they are not much. Now, that is not a problem. The problem now is, why are they struggling so hard to convince you that they are in charge of the ESN? Why are they now sharing video of a protest by, uh, organized by our Lion Squad and they are now, you know, taking the glory of a protest they themselves have cancelled in Biafra land? The same DOS, the same criminal China Sangworu bed bug, all of them have cancelled any protest with Biafra flag in Biafra land. Any protest with the Biafra flag in Biafra land, they suspended it. And even before our leader abduction, we say we don't want to put our people in danger because the Nigeria government will not look twice to start killing them. So if China Sangworu actually organized the, the show of the Lion Squad you saw, or we, you know, which I doubt, if he is the one who organized it, or who asked the men to go to the street? Did you not see that it is exp he is exposing our men to danger? Trying to prove a point. Trying to tell you that they are still intact. They are not, they are intact, but they are not under his command. Now, if he is now sharing the video and telling some of the Iraq to go online and start sharing the video and sharing some messages that, oh, you see, our this is intact, this is our lion squad protesting. Are you not worried that they are exposing our men to the Nigeria security agents to be killed? Or have they now reached agreement with the Nigeria security agents that normally kill them in each time the Biafra flag comes out? So nobody attack them. It is unnecessary. It is unnecessary. And so for the fact that our lions, that our lion squad, Anambra State, came out yesterday to protest. It is time to take the bull by its horn. So China Samoru is now sharing a video of a protest in Biafra land while he is canceling protests in Turkey, while he is canceling protests in the civilized world, including discouraging protests in America. But now he wants to tell you that he still has, that is some men who are now in Lion Squad. My people do not be deceived. And that is what I have come to expose this evening. Because it is synonymous to Nigeria government uh, scam. The more you look, the less you see. I want you to go to the bed bug, China Samoru's page. He posted it. But at the same time, they are condemning protest. And you know that the worst thing you can do is to come out and expose yourself 
to be killed by the Nigeria state. That because they were not attacked yesterday by the Nigeria army is either because some people have consulted the Nigeria army not to attack them, you know, let us have this and all that. Because, you know, you can't even wear Biafra uh, uh, cloth. <laughs> not to talk of protesting and having Biafra flag. They are going to shoot you. They're going to come and attack you and all that. So our men took risk yesterday by protesting with Biafra flag and also on the street of uh, Onecha, our Lion Squad. It was the highest risk. We can achieve um, many things with civil disobedience without taking risk. Without taking such risk. It was complete risk they took. As I commend them and I encourage them to not take such risk again, I am calling on them. They must channel their energy towards something that will yield result. Toward not propaganda, not propaganda uh, uh, a protest, not a protest targeted, targeted at getting to Simon Ekpa, not a protest targeted at getting to people who are genuinely fighting for the release of Pazina Ntikano. No! Your protests, your actions must be targeted at a result, result-based action that will affect the release of Mazin Amdikano. That is what you have to be targeted. Protesting on the street of Biafra will not change, will not make the governors to change, will not make the federal government to change. It is not going to do anything for Mazin Amdikano to be released. So we must begin to channel our energy to be very productive in whatever we do, it must be a, uh, a, a you know, uh, a, a, you know, we, we, we have a target and let that target yield some result. It must be a result-based, you know, uh, uh, protest. So coming to the street of Onicha to protest is a good thing, awareness showing that we are brave and we are not afraid, but it does not add anything to the release of Mazin Amdikano. The only thing that will make Mazin and to be released, and we put the politicians and leaders of the Southeast to start running up and down, is when we begin to enforce every civil disobedience that we have put in place. So the Lion Squad should channel their energy towards that, that, that end. Enforcing the economic sanction, enforcing whatever we, uh, we have to ask them to do, that is where we are going to make a, you know impact, not protesting. <laughs> we have passed the stage of coming to Biafra Street to protest. No, we have passed that stage. And Mazin Amdikano, and Mazin Amdikano, even before his abduction, have, you know, canceled and suspended any protest with Biafra flag. So why would China Sanwaru today, just because they are losing ground, just because Biafra are opening their eyes, just because people have come to understand that they are criminals and they are betraying Mazin Amdikano, they are posting video of our, our gallant uh, lion squad protesting in Onicha. And the, the, the thing is that, oh, look, we, our ESN is intact. Our men are intact. And when you look at the number and the way the protest was organized, you find out that, you know, <laughs> they, are, they are not much. Our Lion Squad protests yesterday, they were not much. So that is what I have come to expose.